Hey guys, today I'll be showing you guys how to make a Discord bot with no coding required. So let's get straight into it. So the first link in the description will instantly start your download for the file, which I already have. So first we we'll want to extract the files, ready and set to go. So to get this bot working, you'll need node.js, which is basically how you're going to self host the bot. After you've downloaded it, It'll be very simple setup and all that. It's very simple. It's not hard at all. All right, we want to head over to Discord Developer Portal, which will also be in the description. We'll go new application. I'm going to name it Subscribe Bot, and we'll create it. We want to pick a neat icon according to Discord, and we'll go save changes. All right, we'll head over to Bot, press Add Bot. We'll do that. Now we'll need our token for the bot to log in. So now that the files are extracted, we'll open that up. We'll head into the data folder. We'll head into the settings.json, which is where you'll put your bot token. So it says bot token here. You'll want to backspace the bot token here and paste in your token as I have just done. Now it says client ID here. You'll want to go over to general information and copy your application ID. Back in there, you want to press Ctrl V to paste it in there. All right, we'll head straight down to the end and it will say bot owner ID. Now basically you'll need to head over to your Discord settings, go to advanced, and it'll say developer mode. You want to tick that, mine's already ticked on, so I don't need to worry about that. We want to right click on our user, copy ID. Now we want to get rid of the bot owner ID and paste our ID in. Press Ctrl S to save the settings. And basically you are good to go. Now what you'll need to do is go over to 002 I think there is and go URL generator you want to press bot administrator you want to press copy link control V to paste it now you want to select your server continue administrator because it is a moderation bot I am a human and we've got to pick dangerous C All right, the bot will now be in the server. Obviously it's gonna be offline because we have not turned it on yet. So you want to head back to your downloads, open up the bot folder. Now you wanna tap on the directory. When I mean tap, I mean click. You wanna type CMD, which will open up the command prompt of the bot's directory. Now you wanna type in node bot.js. Now before we hit enter, I've forgotten a few settings. We need to head back up here, back into the Discord bot developer portal, straight down to bot. Now, if you scroll down, you'll need to tick off these three things. This basically enables the bot to have a custom status and all that stuff, and for the commands to operate correctly. Now you'll head back into the prompt and hit enter with the node bot.js. And now your bot is online. As you can see, the bot is now online. All you have to do is press slash help and you'll get a list of the commands. And basically they all work off each permission that they have been assigned to. So ban would be ban members, etc, etc. Um, thank you guys for watching this video. I hope this helped you out in any way. And I'll see you in the next one.